Thank you for coming back to Polka Dot Mailbox. And if you're new, welcome. Today I'm unboxing for you. <laughs> the reason why I'm laughing <laughs> is because this is a FabFitFun box. I sent Rachel this FabFitFun box last time we did a swap and um, decorated it all up like this. She kept it all this time and has sent it back to me. So I'm unboxing for you a Valentine's Day swap that is um, one that I've done every year. It's been called Super Cupid Swap and I will leave a link to the collection of videos over the years from this swap that we have done. But right now I am unboxing from Rachel and there'll be links down below to all of the other women who are participating in this swap. This time we knew who was sending to us and who um, we were sending to. We usually just knew who we were sending to. So it's not a surprise that this comes from Rachel Tallman and she has made a card for me. Oh, I'm so glad we matched. Isn't that cute? <laughs> That is so funny. Look at that beautiful card with all the layers. Oh my gosh, I love that little heart in there. So this card was made by Brooke from Mint Green Thumb. And the interesting thing about Brooke is she is actually from the same city that I am from. And I used to go to high school with her mom. <laughs> so she is very inspirational. I do really love her work. She was doing a fundraiser and that is where Rachel purchased that card from. So that's really very sweet. She also says that she has gifted me some different things from Valentine swaps of the past. So she said she can't take credit for everything in the box. So I'm gonna actually um, take everything out and then move the box aside and unbox everything for you. I love this shred. <laughs> this is funny. We've got some similar kinds of things. Everything is so beautiful. Make sure I got everything out of here and I just want to share with you actually all of this amazingness. Oh, I love this. I love this. This gold thread and all of these hearts. So beautifully packaged. So I numbered all my things for her and she hasn't numbered them for me. So it's like, I don't even know where to begin. <laughs> Let's begin with something here. Turmeric latte, gold harvest. Wow, this is very surprising looking. This is turmeric latte. Interesting, instant mix. Fantastic, turmeric is so good for you that that is, um, yeah, obviously something that I have never seen before and very, very nice. Okay, so let's start opening with this little pouch. I sent her a little pouch as well. Oh, and inside she has gifted me some purchased items, some Valentine's ribbon, Ooh, and some ribbon tied paper clips. And those are fun. I always get good use out of those. And this is something you could easily recre recreate. That's a nice inspiration. So thank you for those, Rachel. And let's go to the second little bag here. These bags are so cute. I thought maybe this might be a bath bomb. Wow, blush organics. Cozy sweater bath bomb with organic hemp oil and shea butter. Look at how beautiful that is. <laughs> what a great idea. So we often send a mix of purchased items and made items. And we thought we would do like half and half of each. So let's get into, let's get into something that we can see here that she has made. So the first item, this handcraft made item. And have to make sure not to, oh, wow. <laughs> that is cute. Oh, these are beautiful. These are memory dex envelopes that she has made little shaker pockets with. And she's used tool to shake. And I bet you that these are her sequin mixes. What a fun 
embellishment idea or like she has punched the bottoms of them and turned them into memory decks look at those gorgeous sequins wow i love the colors of this one so much they're all so unique and different love is in the air i recognize some maggie holmes um collections here okay hmm. let's try this one looks like a tag flip beautiful packaged everything so pretty as well oh this is a little flip book i just love this little ribbon oh my gosh these enamel dots in the heart shape with the glitter inside them and look at this stitching around the side that's a beautiful stitch wow and this is a shaker on the front this is stitched all the way around the chipboard pieces i love when crafters do that it's so beautiful <laughs> first of all you're really pretty you're so cool <laughs> it's so fun i love it these are all little journaling cards stitched around the edge of each one there's another one of her envelopes used this is a smaller version i love it what a beautiful embellishment that is just so gorgeous and again with one of her sequin mixes she has a subscription that she offers where you can subscribe and get a, a series of sequin mixes every month it's such a neat idea i love that so much sequins are such a hard thing to be able to find this is just beautiful squeeze this is great um i know all these collections and they're uh, escaping me at the moment this is crepe paper but i can't remember the name of that collection this is too i have had all of these this is actually one of my favorite chipboard pieces from la la love that's what i'm trying to think of these are some la la love pieces so beautiful yeah i love that and she's got a little tassel on the end just gorgeous lovely 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 okay well let's keep going with the things that we can see this is a heart mini album. and this says happy galentine's day <laughs> that saying is really taking off now and a lot of people are celebrating Valentine's with the people in their life, their loves. No longer just romantic partners, but also even friends and family. So these are beautifully stitched. And <laughs> I choose you. Sending you all my love. My heart to you. Oh, I love this collection as well. This is from Simple Stories. And I don't have any more of that collection left, which is a shame as it was really very beautiful. She's really mixed a bunch of different collections here. This would look to me like Rosie's Studio, but I could be mistaken. I don't recognize this collection specifically, but it has that kind of feel. I love how she's ripped all of the different pages to layer together, stitched around, and then embellished. Your music to my ears, true friendship. Very pretty. This is a neat box. Oh, oh, this looks like Jan Hatfield on the box. Very unique. So I'm just trying to see. Like this is stitched, so it must be stitched and then glued on, trimmed with these little pom poms. A little B. Quite different. And inside is filled with all kinds of gorgeousness. Look at these. Beautiful. First of all, look at the inside. That's so cute. With a little map and the little house and church. Look at those beautiful flowers. Wow. Those are stunning. So, flowers are such a useful embellishment to gift and to receive because they are so easy to add on to any project. 
and they're so they really elevate everything so these are those little foam hearts that she has gifted me in all sorts of different colors like they she had used for packaging look at these yummy beads mm. <laughs> like these are beautiful and i make lots of charms and things i really love that um aesthetic right there with all of these colors like those are so pretty I will make beautiful tassels and things. Look at that bead goes through that, that part. That's an, an interesting idea. Like a little bubblegum pink. So cute and useful. And then she tucked in some fun little candies. Some Smarties and a ring pop. Just like from when uh, we were kids. <laughs> used to get little ring pops. What a cute little embellishment box that is. Very nice. And what have we got here? So this one is some sort of a cute container that's been handmade. Hmm, is it a backpack? Is it a, yes, it is a backpack. <laughs> it's got this cute little shaker heart here. And then a little Velcroed pouch on the front with Smarties inside. Very smart. <laughs> that's the perfect size to fit Smarties. She's got the straps stitched on the back. So cute. If you haven't seen my um, decor of my bay window and my three-tier tray, I use all of the items from my previous swaps to put in, um, in on display every Valentine. So this is definitely something that I will be adding to my three-tier tray or bay window. And it will be the cutest little 3D project to um, remember Rachel and this swap that we have this year. So again, more of those Smarties, which are beautifully decorated. What a cute idea. So these could be like class Smarties. And um, you could write the names of your friends on the back. Okay. Look at this cute pouch. I see some, one of my favorite products. You see some like, some beauty items in this package. And I love this ribbon. I will definitely be reusing this pink with gold. Look at this beautiful little basket. Wow. She has hand stitched or hand stitched, machine stitched the um, handles. This is such a cute idea. I love these little faceted gems and how they really just sparkle on the handle, like as if it was a real little purse basket that you would use to carry. Beautiful paper. That's gorgeous. She's stitched all the way around. Love it. That is so neat. And the thing that I was saying is my favorite is Burt's Bees Lip Balm. I absolutely adore this. Coconut is one of my favorite all-time flavors. Coconut, vanilla, anything yummy. So I've never tried coconut pear before. So that's nice that she's gifted me something new to try. Raspberry tangerine. Again, more yummy smelling scents. That's it got some little pom-poms in here. I want to show you the inside of her um, little basket here as well so you can see how it's made on the inside. So cute. Very spring. This could go on my three-tiered tray actually for Easter because it has a definite um, consistency with some of the Easter colors I decorate with. Again, those gorgeous faceted gems. I love them so much butterflies and flowers. It's making me excited for spring. Milk chocolate, my favorite beverage if I'm not drinking water, which I usually am. Here's my water cup right here. I always have one nearby. And um, if I'm not drinking water, I'm drinking hot chocolate, maybe a tea. There we go there. So that is so cute. Make some room to show you. This one's heavy. So she has decorated this. Very cute. And actually, I'm going to take these off 
and save them. She's layered up. There we go. I can use that as an embellishment. It's very pretty. And then let's see what's inside this beautiful old wrapping paper. Hmm. <laughs> oh wow, I've never seen these before. Cupcake gummies. Those are too cute to eat. It's funny, I'm not a big cupcake fan specifically, but I love the look of cupcakes, so that's really fun. I'll definitely share these with my kids. Um, cinnamon hearts. This is one of my favorite flavors of candy, is to have a cinnamon flavored thing, or tea or anything. Really love the flavor of cinnamon, so that's lovely. Another beautiful one. I'll have to cut that one off after I don't want to rip it and it doesn't feel like it's going to just pop off like the other one came off nicely. Mm, looks like face masks perhaps. Let's see what's inside here. Mm, combination of some things. I love opening presents. Nowadays everyone uses gift bags more than hand wrapped gifts. And um, hand wrapped gifts are just uh, bring me back to childhood. These are beautiful. Thank you for those, Rachel. Oh my gosh, I will get such good use out of those. Pastel are my favorite colors to work with. And that is wonderful. I'm so happy to have those. Stone Clover Lane Hydrating Mask. Oh, and a cute little happy face. It's beautiful. Thank you. What is this? I love this. This is like my favorite um, packaging so far, I think, because uh, I just love everything about the colors and the design. Let's open it up and see what's inside. Beautiful sequins, like gorgeous sequins. I was excited by the idea because she has her own sequin subscription that she might send some sequins to me so I really appreciate this because these are my favorite colors to work with like this pastel happiness just in a box <laughs> that's beautiful thank you for that Rachel oh everything is so lovely hmm, what is this Something handmade and repackaged. Yeah. Oh, wow. Love that. That is really neat. Okay. Wow. Look at these clouds. So these are shaker clouds. I should do them the package so you can get a good look at them. Those. They're made with like, they're made with a vellum, but it looks almost like the vellum is pink, but that might just be picking up on the background color. I can't tell if this is colored vellum or not. No, that looks like it's clear. Look at that. Those are so pretty. That's nice. Oh, that'll be a gorgeous layering piece for a scrapbook page or um, a card. And these are the cutest little shaker tickets. I love little things. Little mini beautiful. Timeless memory, inspire, discover, a lasting intriguing, a lasting friendship intriguing. So nice. And last but not least, we have some, ooh. Oh, <laughs> some stickers. And the reason why I say aw is because I love gnomes. So let's actually just pull this one out because I don't know what it is with you. I'm on a gnome kick lately. And I actually bought some Valentine stickers from the dollar store. Like these are dollar store stickers and they are so cute. I did um, buy them for my daughter and I to create Valentine's for her class. And I was so enthralled with them. I actually purchased some for myself for my own crafting because they were so cute. I can't believe what gorgeous stickers they're coming out with at the dollar store now. These are all foam stickers and they've got a gold foiling to them. They're so cute. 
So these are also from that line. I didn't see anything like this. That's very nice. And these I absolutely love. Wow. I love faceted stick um, gems and they're so hard to find and those are beautiful. Oh, I look forward to crafting with all of these just perfect wow thank you so much rachel for everything that you sent to me it's a very thoughtful creative gorgeous set of products that i will love and display for future years oh i didn't talk about this gorgeous little wand that she's created here as well out of this layering piece of a nesting die with those stars and stuff super cute. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Like I said, there are many women in this swap doing Valentine's Day swaps and I will link them all down below so you can watch the entire series. It's such a fun event that we do every year and such a talented group of crafters that participate each and every year. So thank you so much for watching and we'll see you again next time.